What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Josh back with another video. And if you guys are new to the channel and you're not subscribed, please make sure you guys go down and smash that subscribe button and turn that notification bell on so y'all don't miss any dope videos. Today, I'm about to go into the nail salon, about to do a little bit of self care, get my pedicure, and get a manicure, you know, so I can start feeling good, get my week started off right. One thing for sure, fellas, make sure y'all taking care of yourself, man, and doing some self care. It ain't feminine to go get your feet done and go get a manicure. Now, I mean, I feel you if you don't want to get a manicure. I mean, I don't know how you feel about that. But if you want to get a pedicure, at least do that. But see, I got my manicure done for the first time. And I was like, man, it makes my hands feel much better. It makes me look more presentable and well put together. Because a lot of times your nails can be all dirty and scratched up and stuff. And I feel like, you know, it's a nice appearance. And to be honest, a lot of women like when they see that you keep yourself up. When you're smelling good, you're looking good. I've gotten so many compliments on me just getting my manicure done, man. They always be like, that's some grown man stuff. Cause only the real know about that. You know, it's really just top tier self care. You know, you feel like your highest self when you're doing that. So I'm about to go in here to the nail salon. After I leave there, I'm about to head over to this barber store and go pick up some new trimmers. And I'm gonna go to the shop and I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up. Your boy feeling refreshed, man. Feet feeling good, looking good. Hands feeling good, looking good. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can't be walking around with no dirt all in your nails and your hands look dirty and stuff. I mean, that ain't my stilo, but you know, whatever floats y'all boat. But me, I'ma get fresh. And like I said, man, this ain't no feminine type vibe. Y'all just need to tap in and just start taking care of yourself a little bit more. And make you feel better about yourself. Other than that, though, I'm about to head over to this barber store, pick up these new, new tools, you know what I'm saying? These new hitters I'm about to be having. Then when I get to the shop, I'm going to show y'all what I caught. We made it to the shop. Ain't nothing really changed since the last video. You know, the wall's still blank, but we're getting everything situated, man. This spot is gonna be real nice, and I can't wait to show you guys the update. Once I get more moved in, and this week I actually got a lot more appointments than I did last week. I think so far I got like one, two, I got like six or seven appointments booked this week. All new people down here in ATL, and I can't wait to meet them and show you guys some more tutorials. But let me show you guys what I picked up at the store. Even though I'm late to the party, I ended up picking up those new Babyliss Snap FX trimmers, man. These joints is so nice in hand. And I can't wait to show you guys on a review or maybe a tutorial what they hitting on. But for now in this video, I'm gonna just show you guys a little bit of what they do. And I really like these. I like the concept of them. And I think I'm gonna really like them. So if you guys haven't heard about them or you're not hip to them, the reason why they're called the Babyliss Snap FX is because they have a rechargeable, detachable, um, battery that it comes with. I'm gonna show you guys how you charge them later, but this is why they call them the snap FX because you put this in kind of like when you're loading a pistol <laughs> and then you just snap it in just like that. And it's rechargeable and when you turn it on, it has like a blue ring right here and it just stays on and it um, actually starts blinking when it's time to charge it. And let me show you guys how you charge them and everything it comes with. So it comes with this charging stand and the rest area for the clipper without the um, rechargeable batteries in it. As you guys can see behind it, it has both of the batteries charging. And you know, once they're dead, you just drop it in. You just drop it in, got one on both sides when you're not using them. But you know, if you're using them, you would have one inside and one charging. And then when the clipper goes dead, you just swap it out. Oh yeah, one more thing it has, it has like this removable plate in the front under the blade where you can like take this off it's a magnet and you can like take it off to clean under the blade you know it gets dirty under there and they made it to where you can just take this off and just put it under there. and this also snaps too so maybe that's why they call it the snap fx you know because it has this and the battery part but it just snaps back on because it's a magnet just like just like that and yeah i don't have the battery in here but 
you get the picture i showed you guys how it charges so yeah that's pretty much it so far as far as like first look in hand i'm gonna do a you know a full review later for you guys and show you guys on the tutorial maybe in a review how they hit and you know are they worth it because these are about 300 dollars and um that's a lot of money but you know for what you get it's something different it just depends on if you have the money to really spend that but you know i like them and i can't wait to see how they hit hope you guys like this video and uh, make sure you guys all subscribe to the channel and make sure you guys turn the notification bell on and follow me on instagram at joshxbarber like y'all see at the top of the video it's your boy josh peace